Aries, hi and welcome to your love reading. This is for Sun, Moon and Rising Aries. If you are returning to my channel, welcome back. If you are new, welcome. Thanks for stopping by. Coral Tree Tarot here. These readings are timeless and general, so only take what resonates. Um, and let's jump right into it, Aries. Let's see what are the messages here for you. What's happening for Aries? What are the messages here for Aries? Aries people, Sun, Moon and Rising. What's happening for Aries here? Let's start with this three. We have the wild card, we've got drama and we have patience. Uh, I feel your person is not <clears throat> showing you exactly how they feel, what they want. There is a... <clears throat> There's a little bit of um, a, a message messages here about just hiding something. Um, I, I'm not getting anything negative, but I feel your person may just not clearly um, be expressing themselves. That is definitely something that is creating... Um, Frustration, disappointment, okay, because I feel on your side it's really hard to um, gouge the situation, it's really hard for you to, to see through um, some level of, you know, There's something ambiguous, there's something unclear, there's something that your person is, is hiding. Um, but I have to say, it's, it's not very, I'm not getting a malicious uh, intentions. I, we've got the patience here. And with the chess, for me, this is very strategic movement. <clears throat> this is being, excuse me, this is being... This is trying, um, you know, play out in this situation so that um, in the whole scheme of your, of the connection between you and this person, um, the outcome is, is positive. This person is, is someone who definitely uses a lot of their... Um, intellect um more much more than than following their heart and being really emotional this is someone who's quite um skeptical but it, it, it is someone who's also patient and um whatever your person is not revealing to you whatever you cannot put your finger on i don't think this is malicious as i say the wild card is making me feel, for some of you, it can just totally, you know, be what you think it is. It's the, the definitely, you, if you are feeling, if you're watching this and you're feeling, I feel my person is not telling me something, but I have a bad feeling about it. The, the wild card, it's, it's, you know, they can really surprise you. Um, and this situation, this message, the, this person's action um, can just suddenly shift the situation from A to B or from like, like a 180 degree change. Okay? For some of you, Follow your gut feeling. If you cannot put your finger what's going on with your person, you're probably right. For others of you, I do feel whatever you are not getting, you know, you, you are, there's something they're not telling you. You have doubts. Uh, you, you, you might be right. And with the wild card, this will become, a, you know, obvious clear and very soon I feel although this patient this person is also quite patient so for some of you yes this is something that 
it, it's like slowly in the making like this person is opening themselves up figuring things on their own and and being patient and quite strategic not very much emotional and it would blow your mind in the end you might just be you might just uncover realize or this person will make it finally clear with a wild card that they are in love with you they are plain and simple in love with you but for others of you this this could turn the other way around like you will know that okay i had a feeling i had hunches from the beginning they were playing me now i know okay this is a collective and general rating so aries let's see what else please show me the energies for aries how does this person feel about aries what intentions they have we have knight of pentacles they are slow they're patient this is a very nice energy here to be honest because it says that the intentions are long-term intentions the intentions are to build something that is going to grow roots that is going to be permanent with the pentacle but yes this person is very slow um, and this is the this is that element that makes may make you feel as if you really cannot figure out what this person wants because they are slow in in responding slow in opening up the connection is just quite slow things are not you know the the pace is very slow and it make you may make you feel like oh they're not interested or they don't they want something else or they're dealing with someone else um but for the knight of pentacles no this person is um slow for a reason patient for a reason they are um ace of cups wonderful love quote we have aries there is love here there is love here they want to be the rock for you the emperor in a position of the future um the temperance i feel you need patience I feel you really need patience and I feel this person is is needing patience and I feel they are building up um, the courage to make it known to you that they are head over heels in love with you. Um, they have been from the beginning Queen of Cups in the position of the past. I feel you clicked um, instantly the angel here um, the temperance angel it's a perfect alchemy this angel is mixing two chalices the, this is how they felt about you two from the beginning um so this wild card is definitely going to manifest itself if you cannot put a finger on this person and, and their feelings for you this is how they feel about you aries they are in love they love you and i do feel with the emperor in the position of the future this person is not going anywhere this is not a ghoster this is someone that has a lot of life experience experience in relationships um for some of you this person may have had marriage um previously may have been married previously and they are there, there, this is someone who's definitely available and who wants to be the one for you this is what i'm getting they see themselves the one for you, Aries. Could be a fellow Aries, um, Sagittarius or a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. This is a patient, strategic, thoughtful um, person. I feel if your person is not, um, it's it's not you know revealing their feelings clearly this definitely feels frustrating that mask here definitely makes you feel um frustrated but 
There's a reason why they are not showing their feelings. I want to know more about the temperance. Why do we need to be patient? Why does this person want to be patient? Why is the timing so important? Okay, it is what they have always wanted. There is justice here as well. And we've got the tower. I feel this person really wants to avoid uh, having here the tower and the justice. I, uh, this we are clarifying the the temperance here. I feel your person wants to avoid um, building the situation, building the relationship with you, rushing and building it on wrong foundations. They don't want the tower moment to happen for you. Um, the justice really makes me feel that this is someone who wants to do things well um, in a fair way. I am also getting karma. It's as if your person kind of understands that if they make mistakes, if they rush to too much, this is going to get them in a form of some sort of, you know, these two, in a form of failure, literally, and the justice in a form of karma, like, they, they really, this is everything that this person's ever wanted. The Nine of Cups. So they, they want to be patient here. They want to be strategic, they are strategic, and, um... And I feel this is why. I really feel your person wants to avoid this situation for you. They don't want to build the relationship with you. Um, they don't want to fast track so that you guys... Um, let's say, misunderstand each other's needs, each other's um, expectations, each other's perspective for this connection. And therefore, um, you know, that tower moment could have happened for you too in the future. So that's why they are strategic and patient. And I really feel, especially with the the emperor here this is this person really they know what they want they want you tell me more about the Aries tell me more about the emperor here yeah they, they, they want a beginning that is going to grow they want a new beginning with the ace of pentacles they want your life uh, but a life that will spring roots, a beginning that will spring roots. Beautiful to aces for you. It does feel as if this is something new. Aries, please let me know in the comments. We have Libra um, and Scorpio here as well. Let me just pull one or two more messages. I have so much I want to say to you. And someone is also very attracted to you. You have ignited fire within me. Okay. Still a little bit of astrology. Tell me. Please tell me. Tell me what is happening here for Aries. Something beautiful. Juno commitment. And we have Mars here on the bottom of the deck. And that is the Aries. This is that energy. This is this action energy. Aries and Scorpio. This is this very masculine energy. Even if it's a woman, uh, Aries, there is a lot of masculine energy about this person. This person is a um, creator. Juno, commitment. That's what's happening here for you, Aries. Thank you for your time and your energy. Um, if this resonates, leave me a comment. That's all that I have for you today. Take care, Aries, and I'll speak to you soon. Goodbye for now.